to do two songs that we didn't write, and you'll be familiar with both of them, I hope. You know, for two people who uh, have, uh, at our advanced age, combined ages of more than 140 years, uh, we have done remarkably little dancing in our, li in our lives, but uh, uh, several of these songs have to do with dancing. So, anyway. <laughs> Have you seen the well-to-do Strolling up Park Avenue With their noses in the air On that famous thoroughfare High hats and arrow collars White spats and lots of dollars Spending every dime For a wonderful You're blue and you don't know where to go to Why don't you go where fashion sits Putting on the Ritz Different types with lots of C notes Pants with stripes and cutaway coats Perfect fits Putting on the Ritz Strolling down the avenue so happy all dressed up just like an English chappy Very snappy, come let's mix We're Rockefellers, walk with sticks Or rumbarellas in their mitts Putting on the mitts Like a million dollar trooper Trying hard to look like Bradley Cooper Super duper, come let's mix We're Rockefellers, walk with sticks Or umbrellas in their mitts Putting on the Ritz Putting on the Ritz In the pale winter, 
winter moonlight of our lives. In the pale winter moonlight of our lives, we'll be watching the horizon. Morning stars are rising in the pale winter moonlight of our lives. sitting uh, in a room a few years back and uh, about this time of year uh, and sitting by a western window and the sundown was, light was coming through and it was just gorgeous and really got real excited. It says, it's the late golden summer. <laughs> a one, two, three. Take you dancing on your birthday when you're 81, just you and I, and we'll twist and cha 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 for all we're worth. And in the act of love, that night maybe we'll die. But if we do survive, next day we'll walk the garden. What crops we want and what seeds we might buy. We might have to expand and talk about traveling abroad. And if not to a cute little spot, just you and I. There'll be new shows, new music to applaud. New songs I'll play and, and I'll sing. So don't forget that's what I want And when you're 82 We have a date for dancing me and you That's what I want And when you're 82 We have a day for dancing Me and you We have a day for dancing Me and you Um, the 
this next song is dedicated to Pastor Dan's grandfather or great-grandfather, whoever he was, who preached a whole sermon against dancing. <laughs> Which I think is a waste of time, but any, not dancing. I, think, I don't think that's a waste of time. But anyway, personal opinion, I'm not trying to start a doctrine or anything. abandoned when this seed has been planted and has died it will rise with an honor that we cannot imagine to the glory of our Lord crucified in his gaze Will our hearts be corrected? Our dreams and our wishes be made right. We will sing, we will praise, and less songs and endless ways, and we will dance before the Lord with all our might. In Him all hearts are mended. In Him all words are sure. have ended, in him all love is pure. We will dance, we will shout, we will praise him with a joy we could never hear express. We will next song. Uh, these are little sacred eggs. I'm the egg man. And if you don't know what that means, then that's okay. But if you do, then all the better. Isaiah 40. There's yeah, probably the a Bible Isaiah. out there if you want to look it up. Isaiah 40, 
21 to 26, if you want to pull out your pew Bible, or not. Scarcely has their stock taken root in the earth, but he merely blows on them, and the wither and the storm carries them away like stubble.
a little intense. <clears throat> this uh, next song is um, based on a true story, a family story, and it's about a blind date that went really, really well. I worked with this beautiful HR director with red hair, lovely woman, and I kept telling my brother about her, and he kept saying, when are you going to bring my redhead down to meet me? You know, when, when are you going to bring her down? So one day, we, we joined my brother at a marina, and we went out on the water, and it was obviously love at first sight. They ended up getting married, they bought a marina, and they, had a, they opened a cafe called the Lighthouse Cafe, and that's the name of this song. And by the way, my brother was an incredibly good dancer. My earliest musical memories are watching my mother and my brother put on 78s and dance in the living room, and my father and I, who, who weren't good dancers, we just kind of sat there and watched in awe. But anyway, the Lighthouse Cafe. In the years of Katrina, good gumbo at the Lighthouse Cafe. Weary travelers came and stayed, they listened to the music played at night at the Lighthouse Cafe. Everybody, Everybody all around said there was, was not a place in town compared to the Lighthouse Cafe. Cafe. Everybody everywhere they knew they didn't have a care in dancing at the Lighthouse Cafe. Lighthouse Cafe. Cafe. First time he ever saw her, she was sailing on the water, red, red hair, hair, blue eyes, and cream. cream. Said he'd never seen a girl who took in all the world and danced like, like an, an angel's, angel's dream. dream. She swore she didn't need a man, but she had never seen a man who made her want to dance again. again. Right from the start, he melted her heart with sunshine and birds on the wind. Oh, she danced in his arms. Oh, he danced in her heart. He swept her away under the storm. At the, the Lighthouse, lighthouse Cafe. Cafe. song I wrote for my sweetie uh, 42 years ago. 
But then my wife found out about it, so. <laughs> no, he'd be a dead man. Some days are copper pennies that you spend and never miss And some are nickel worth more than the rest When silver lining shone through clouds of dull and leaden gray It came in ways I never would have guessed Some days were shining iron at first but tarnished all too fast and rusted out in time and couldn't stay. The bid some days I'd like to bronze and keep, but this is true. The golden days I've spent were all with you. The, the only, only things, things worth keeping that I have were given, given me. The, the things, things I labor for will pass away. The precious things of life I've known could not be bought or sold, but freely when I needed them, they came. Some days are copper pennies that you spend and never miss. Some are nickel worth more than the rest. When silver lining shone through clouds of dull and leaden gray, it came in ways I never would have guessed. Some days were shining iron at first, but tarnished all too fast, and rusted out in time and couldn't stay. Then some days I'd like to bronze and keep, but this is true. The golden days I've spent were all with you. Now is still the proper time to speak my love to you and tell you that I love you more today. The confidence you've given me in love that will remain is worth the gratitude a lifetime can't repay. Some days are copper pennies that you spend and never miss. Some are nickel worth more than the rest. When silver lining shone through clouds of dull and leaden gray, it came in ways I never would have guessed. Some days were shining iron at first, but tarnished all too fast and rusted out in time and couldn't stay. There been some days I'd like to bronze and keep, but this is true. The golden days I've spent were all with you. Then some days I'd like to bronze and keep, but this is true. The golden days I've spent were all with you. Truer now than ever before. Um, so we've got some, <clears throat> I wouldn't call them old friends, we've got some friends who've been friends for a long time. We're old, but they're not. <clears throat> Uh, some years back, Aurelia and I were involved in uh, writing, producing, and performing uh, a one-act musical play based on the book of Jonah. It was called The Whale and I. I was the whale. <laughs> you were a Ninevite? Good casting, good casting. Yeah, well... Uh, a couple of times in the play, Jonah and the Whale. I, I was the whale because I had the bass voice. Was you know, well, um, they they talk and uh, sing a couple of songs and do a little dance. We're not going to do the dance, so the song's going to be kind of short. But uh,
it's best to obey cause every other way is the wrong one it's best to obey it always comes out better in the long run God's got a plan for every man and well yes it's true even a whale of a fishy tail can happen to you so go when he says go and stay when he says stay you know it's best to obey it's best to obey when abraham did god called him righteous it's best to obey or something might happen that is frights us god's got a plan for every man and well yes it's true even a whale of a fishy tail can happen to you so go when he says go and stay when he says stay composer of of the was it the opening number i think the opening yes. number this for the gentleman here in the maroon this shirt um, this is kurt de cordova and he wrote this song that the that, Ninevite song that all the children went around singing all the time to their parent driving their parents to distraction <laughs> and it's called we're mean we're nasty we're mean we're, we're nasty, nasty we're, we're nasty, nasty and we're mean we're, we're the, the most disgusting folks, folks that you have ever, ever seen yes. we're mean we're nasty sometimes we're downright crude sometimes we even belch a lot when we digest our food <laughs> and it goes on okay anyway, last song. number this is the second song that we did not write here yeah the great irving berlin uh born in russia grew up in new york uh I've read that his earliest memory was standing by the side of the road, but dressed, wrapped in a blanket watching his house burn down because of the persecution of the Jews in, in Russia. Anyway, this is a song about dancing. I just got an invitation through the mail. Your presence requested this evening, it's formal. Top hat, white tie, and tails. Nothing now could take the wind out of my sails. Because I'm invited to step out this evening, top hat, white tie, and tails. I'm putting on my top hat, tying up my white tie. Brushing off my tails I'm dooting up my shirt front Putting in shirt studs Polishing my nails I'm stepping out, my dear To breathe an atmosphere That simply reeks with class And I trust that you'll forgive my dust When I step on the gas or I'll be there Putting down my top hat Mussing up my white tie Dancing in my tails simply reeks with class and I try 
trust that you'll forgive my dust when I step on the gas. For I'll be there, putting down my top hat, busting up my white tie, dancing in my tails. Thank you. Thank you so much. If I could tap dance on. Well, not on. Uh, that's our show. Thank you. Thank you. All right, can you hear me now? Okay. Um, first of all, uh, can we can we give Aurelia and William another hand, please? I'd appreciate it. Okay. I'd, like to, I'd like to thank Aurelia and William for their great performance. I loved it. And these other folks, uh, Dr. Dan, and for Bonnie, for Charlotte being with us, and Nancy helping with the program today. Um, I missed any particular. Oh, and Andy up in the booth. Yay. Okay. All right. Anyhow, so now, this is just the minor closing part of the closing section, whatever, but uh, so you'll have to bear with me on this. Uh, uh, you can sit down if you like. I mean, that's. Uh, this is worth sharing. This is, okay. It's worth or not worth? Okay. All right. Are you ready? Dang. A man had issues with riding in a carpool. He was concerned with being trapped driving in a tunnel with other folks. His phobia was called carpool tunnel syndrome. <laughs> okay, never mind. It's not my age that bothered me, it's the side effects. I'm not saying I'm old and worn out, but I make sure I'm nowhere near the curb on trash day. <laughs> me sobbing. Oh, I'm not coming back here anymore. I'm not going to let you hurt me again. My trainer. It was one sit up. <laughs> As I've gotten older, people think I'm becoming lazy. The truth is I'm just becoming more energy efficient. I haven't got anything done today. I've been in the produce department trying to open this stupid plastic bag. <laughs> Let's see, number eight. Okay, I put my scale in the bathroom corner and that's where the little liar will stay until it apologizes. <laughs> Apparently, RSVPing to a wedding invitation Maybe next time is not the correct response. Okay. She says, and this is a, this is a combo, this is a, this, this is a pair. She says, I keep pushing her buttons. If that were true, I would have found mute by now. Then again, God promised men that good and obedient wives would be found in all corners of the world. And then he made the earth round and laughed and laughed and laughed. <laughs> Anyhow, all right, thank you. Charlotte, are you uh, around here? There's our young lady. You do the closing prayer, please.
Okay, can we do our regular closing as we do our covenant of the, of the congregation? Go forth into the world in peace, have courage, hold on to what is good, return to no person evil for evil, strengthen the faint-hearted, support the weak, this help the suffering, honor all persons, love and serve the Lord, rejoicing in the power of the Holy Spirit. Thank you all very much for coming today. Appreciate it. Thank you. Let's see, do I need to take this off?